Hi. Hey, everybody. Okay. Hi. I'm just going to wave now. <laughs> so uh, we're at uh, Bucks Lake near Quincy. We're uh, we're just taking a drive. We're gonna go walk. Dam's behind us. See the dam. Ah, uh, anyway, we are. Uh, uh, we're slacking this week. We've been slacking, and uh, we got some cool shot, uh, shots yesterday from our little drive. But yeah, we're yeah, not. Yeah, I, really... uh, I might even I might even edit those into some kind of uh, montage or something. You never yeah. know. But uh, you know, we're uh, we're just kind of uh, uh, recovering from our uh, what's going on. Four weeks of uh, drama from my colonoscopy. And then helping my dad get home, and then, uh, you know, just all the other stuff. Basically, other people's schedules. You know. Henry, Henry left. Yeah, Henry left. Um, Dan went to the emergency room. Yeah, and then we that. Henry had a heart attack. Yeah, we we just had a lot of um, emotional, emotionally taxing things happening. Yeah. So, so you know, and like I said, you know, we spent like the better part of three weeks on. Uh, wow. Well, we gotta go through. Are you sure here. this is okay to walk on? Yeah. Are you, no, uh, oh my god. It's fine to walk on. Ah! It's just, what, what are you doing? She's all worried about this. Oh my gosh, there's like, See? we'll show them what it is and now. See what it is? Oh my gosh. I can't look down. A, I can't look whoa. down. It's just a wooden bridge. Go on, it goes over the dam. It's got these things on them. See? Right there? That's like we're driving on. But you're not allowed to drive on it. Well, I bet the people who uh, run the dam drive on it. I don't know, it says no motorized vehicles allowed. Okay, are you done? Yeah. Are you done freaking out? Anyway, Sorry. we, uh, uh, you know, we've been on other people's schedules for a while, and, and that's that's a little taxing. Especially when we're used to not doing that. You know, kind of doing what we want when we want. You know, it's not always bad, but I mean, it's just, it's kind of, you know, taxing. So, am I in your way? Sorry. Know, let's just get every way to take a picture. So uh, anyway, this is this is probably gonna be an old-fashioned. Uh, it's not that old. <laughs> We've only done two of the new format. Um, week in the lives. This is gonna be an old-fashioned week in the life. And uh, just for the record, we're we're probably gonna. Uh, I think we already discussed it on Friday, but uh, you know, not every week um, warrants you know uh, the same kind of format. So some weeks these might be. Better some weeks the the ones like the Yosemite video, where we did the uh, uh, you know the sit down talk and talked about it in depth and stuff. Other weeks it might just be you know like the other one where we just you know do a little intro and show you pictures of what we've been doing and just kind of so. Yeah, anyway. um, we're gonna keep it flexible actually. That yeah. way we'll make a video that the week warrants. As usual, Jen's back there Instagramming. She's all freaking out because uh, of the uh, 45 degree slope. I don't know why. Is it not? It, it literally, it really is when I'm walking, I'm having, <laughs> how is it I can climb those big rocks and I have no problem, but this is like freaking me out. See, I told you, it's freaking her out. I don't it's, know why. It, it, it's like I'm having so much vertigo. It's not funny. I mm. don't know why. I don't know. Hopefully we don't run out of battery. We didn't bring an extra one. And we're down to uh, two bars out of three, so. Um, anyway, it is a Saturday before Memorial Day, and it is about 50 degrees out here. And it's been raining. How, how many how many days in a row has it rained on us? Like a week solid, Seriously, at least part of the day? Yeah, it has a week yeah. solid. And it's supposed to be clearing up today, but it's not. Tomorrow, it says it's supposed to be 76 here. Hmm. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. We're gonna walk back. No, it's just more damn. So, we're gonna walk back and hit a day use area, check it out, go down to the water. I'd rather be down by the water. Can't get down to the water. Hey, there's a dam.
And the kids down by the dam, we can hear all the way over here. Other than that, it's pretty peaceful. Lots of birds singing. It actually yeah. is very peaceful. Yep. You can hear the water. It's just the kind of, it's just kind of scene where a zombie will come up behind you and like, ah! I was just gonna say, it's just a kind of place that's like really soothing to your soul, but thanks for that, babe. The T-Rex comes crashing through the trees. <laughs> ah! It would be really beautiful if the sun came out. The sun came out for like yeah. five minutes and then... Yeah, it is, it is awfully uh, Pacific Northwest-ish yeah. here at the moment. But... Uh, Not that we don't like that. We do. It's no. just that we need the sun. Yeah, it's, it's been like this for a long time and it's like it shouldn't be right now. I mean, we go to Oregon or Washington, we kind of expect it. But yeah. here it's like it should be sunny. Oh my gosh, look. It's coming out. It's oh, coming yeah, out. Here comes the sun. Yay. I thought there was a zombie. No, it's the oh. sun. Same thing. Whatever. Six to one, half dozen, yeah, both would make me happy. I already got several sticks selected just in case that I could stick in their brain. It's good to know that you're always looking. Yep. Okay. Okay. The next morning. Hola. Uh, yesterday ended abruptly. We, uh, we didn't bring an extra battery, so. Today we have three batteries. So. We are uh, driving on Highway 70 by, I can't remember the name of the river, Indian River, I think maybe, Indian Creek, something like that. Um, we're headed up to Lake Almanor, we're going to take a hike up there, Jen found, but uh, well, it looks like I have to go that way. She was reading a sign, so um, anyway, we, uh, oh, I got to lock the Jeep, hold on. Okay. Anyway, we uh, just get out. It's a nice sunny day. First day in, in a while, honestly. I mean, it was sunny at like Washoe Lake, but it clouded up and rain, like whenever it felt like it. Um, here, it's been pretty much cloudy the whole time. Sun intermittent. But today, it's nice and sunny. Few or no clouds in the sky. It's nice. We're uh, just making a stop on our way. Um, you know, Look, uh, you know, we keep it real, so, uh, no, honestly, I think we're both, or we're, maybe still are, a little overwhelmed by everything. Everything that happened, my dad, back at home, the colonoscopy, blah, 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 blah. So, um, today we're, uh, I think we're both, there's Jen. This is I think helping we're, you. Yeah, we're both feeling better today. Yeah. Honestly, um, my, uh, as I told Jen on the way up. Her noise, or whatever you want to call it, the voices in her head that everyone has. That makes me sound crazy. Not, not the, not, not, not those, not satanic voices or anything. <laughs> you know, always are trying to convince your Jen. negative self-talk. My yeah. negative self-talk is always trying negative to convince me that I'm I've a bad person. That. Right. That I suck, and so I constantly have to fight that struggle. Right. Yeah. His. And we know why. It's yeah. because you know the, her childhood and the way she's brought up and blah blah blah. Sorry, spider webs. Mine, <laughs> my noise. Nate, what'd you call it? Your negative self-talk. My negative self-talk. I'll just, I'll stick with noise. Yeah, noise. My noise is always trying to convince me that I'm going to die. So. So uh, like if his knee hurts? Oh, jeez. And yeah. And or I roll my ankle on a rock while I'm trying to, to vlog. His, if his knee hurts, he said, oh my God, my knee hurts. I'm having a heart attack. Yeah, because right now, right now all my anxiety is heart attack related. Even yeah. though I didn't have a heart attack. At least recently. Yeah. So yeah, every pain, you know, it doesn't oh, matter, you know. Poison oak. Oh, there's poison oak. Wait, great. Oh, it is. It's right there. Which one? There's poison oak. The one that looks like an oak. Oh. See, it's all right there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Don't walk off the trail. No, stay on the trail. <laughs> so, uh, you know, every pain, you know, no matter how unrelated it is to, uh, you know, actual heart attack symptoms, makes me. So, whatever. Just saying. But I feel better today. I've been tired. It could have, it could have been the drugs. Um, that's one of the side effects because one of them slows my heart down. I'm at 55 beats a minute. I was at 60 or 65 beats a minute before, so which is excellent for, for a fat dude my age. It's excellent for a skinny dude my age. Um, but, uh, so, I don't know. That's, it, couldn't, it can make you tired. Now I gotta look around, make sure there's no people. We're not walking in, vlogging, making people uncomfortable, including myself. So it's getting very, very loud here. So, there, basically we're just saying that, you know, we're. 
Wow. We're, we're kind of recovering. So, uh, you know, this week's gonna be really boring. This week's over half over, so. And we've only filmed two days. We have lots of cool B-roll. But there, there will be cool B-roll because wow. there's an excellent waterfall behind us. Oh Where is it? Oh, there it is. See, see? What see the waterfall? That? That's pretty cool. It's funny. Sorry, again, waterfall. It's funny. You know, sometimes you see things or whatever, read things, hear things, and you're like, wow, that resonates. This sign here, it's called the Trickster at Work. The ancient Maidu myths that surround the falls started from the beginning of the world. Kai, excuse my pronunciation, Kodo Yakum, world maker, wanted to place the falls in Indian Valley, making it convenient for the villagers to access. Wepam, we, Weepam, I don't know, Coyote, the trickster, who was always up to mischief, had other ideas. He moved the falls into the narrow canyon where we find it today. While this made fishing more difficult for the Maidu, it serves as a reminder that life is not always easy and we have to work for the things that are most important to us. successfully circumnavigated the rocks behind us. Uh, go over South Falls, it's kinda cool. Uh, didn't touch any poison oak, except for that right there. Just kidding. That's not funny. <laughs> like there gonna, is poison oak right like there. Like he's gonna get out and jump at you or something. I'm so, trying uh, not to touch any kind of plants, just in yeah, case. No plants, they're all poisonous here. So uh, we're gonna head back to the Jeep. And uh, This was a nice little hike though. I saw this you when I was see doing. Me. I'm dark. My research, and uh, research. I I didn't really even pay it any attention. I'm really glad we stopped. It's yeah, cool. it's not a very long hike. I mean, no. There's just one steep section, and then you gotta climb on some rocks. But other than that, it's pretty nice. Indian Creek Falls. Indian Creek Falls, yeah. yeah so it's kind of cool. All, All right, right cool. we're we're going. Bye. Okay. Speaking of anxiety, the trail was much steeper than either of us remember. Yeah, it's not very long, down. but mm -hmm. it is. So. I got a little stress test there. A natural stress test, yeah. Yeah. So, whatever. That's all I need to do. Just get back into the swing of things. Do what I was doing before. This will all be a distant memory at some point. Exactly. So, uh, just gotta get through it though. Exactly. So. All right. But we did it, so good job. We did, and now we're leaving. One hour later. We're at uh, the no fun day use area. Let's Why see, what does no it say? Fun? No fireworks, no camping, no campfires, no glass, do not clean fish, no shooting. That's all I see. Plus yeah. there's also warnings, dire warnings about mountain lions and plague. <laughs> so, they also have the, the water traffic markers just in case you want to take your car out on the lake. I don't know. So, anyway, we arrived here. This is Lake Almanor. And this is not really called No Fun. No, it's day called area. Dyer Day Use Area. Dyer. Dyer. It's D-Y. Yeah. E-R, not Dyer. So if you're able to hear me above the crashing waves, see that? Where'd it go? Where is it? Oh, there it is. See the mountain right there? That's Mount Lassen. We went there last uh, summer. That's Lassen National Park over there. This is Lake Almanor. It's a little windy today, I don't know why. Maybe it's always windy because it's a big lake. I don't know. There's, there's an American flag just out in the middle of the water. Yeah. Yep, there's an American flag in the middle of the water. I would show you, but you probably couldn't see it. Three days later. Hi. 
We're uh, what is with you in the little we're pie at now? Fraser Falls. We were here last year. Mm -hmm. This is this is the trip where we filmed the infamous uh, last episode episode that yep. everyone freaked out about, thinking we were going to stop. Yeah. It was just we used to film episodes. We we call them episodes. And we got to 100. Actually, we got to 101 because I, I got all the way to 95 and then screwed up. And there's two 95s. I think it's 95. Anyway, uh, that was our last episode. Uh, there's lots of giant flying carbon ants. And so we put that in our, you know, in our uh, thumbnail. Description. Thumbnail. The last episode ever. And people freaked. What? what? And, the, you know. That's yeah. Sad. It wasn't good. Yeah. It, it was It was clickbait. But last year when we were Sorry. here, there was no water in the falls. Yeah, we were here later in the year. It was August, I think. Mm -hmm. This is also, I may have mentioned it earlier, I don't remember, at one of the other spots we were at, uh, that I got uh, poison oak. Something. I must have brushed against something. Mm -hmm. But uh, I lived. You did. Uh, obviously. <laughs> if a small heart attack won't kill me, poison oak ain't going to do it. It's too, too soon. soon. It's too soon. <laughs> Is it too soon? Sorry, but hey, it's too I didn't soon. even feel the other one. I don't you know, care. So. These falls weren't going, so they are this year. So there will be or has been B-roll possibly. Jen's taking pictures. I'm taking videos of ants. So uh, down there, we're gonna we're gonna walk down through. It's a really nice trail here. This is a Gold Lakes Basin. Uh, we're, we came in the back way. I don't know how close we were to Gray Eagle and Portola and all that stuff when we were here. We're really close. What are you doing? Butterfly. Oh, butterfly. Squirrel. It's paved. Look at that. It's paved. See? It's paved. All the way. And it's got some really nice a little uh, rock outlook areas. See the falls. It's actually a really nice trail too. It's it's not a difficult trail. I just said that. I mean, like difficult wise, it's not oh. a difficult trail. No, it's not difficult at all. I mean, it's just a steady incline, and so. we'll actually go down. But oh yeah, well I, I'm talking on the way back. Oh, she's bad. talking on the way back. Gotcha. Yeah. One of our subscribers sent us this shirt. And a coffee cup. And a bracelet. And a bracelet. Mm -hmm. One of those rubber ones. And ask Jen to wear it on camera. As you can see, it's for the Peaceful Valley Donkey Rescue. Donkeyrescue.org. Mm -hmm. Looks like a good organization. They save donkeys, you know, from being abused and mistreated and whatever. From all over the country, they actually have chapters now all over the country that take care of the donkeys. So it started in one place and has expanded. Yeah. So I read the brochure. So we agreed, or rather, Jen agreed, to wear the shirt on camera. Yep. So there it is. There's the front of the shirt, by the way. <laughs> and there's the back of the shirt. That, uh, that pretty much ends this, uh, week yeah yeah it's a week we did lots of uh we did lots of cool hikes and stuff and and got some cool b-roll but yeah we for the most part we just sat around and relaxed and tried to just i don't know what the word is decompress decompress yeah 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 so i mean a lot of stuff you know when we were uh Patajo. I mean, we had good times at Pataw. We'd hang out with Dave and Karen and went around the lake and, you know, did a few other things, but we spent a lot of time going back and forth to Carson to deal with family stuff and other stuff, you know. Yeah. We went down there just to go shopping one day, you know, yeah. so we could pay for groceries at Nevada prices instead of California Lake Tahoe prices. You know what happened. Yeah. Well, I guess. I don't know. Maybe you don't know. Maybe I haven't watched the other video. So anyway, you know, when we went to the emergency room and everything and 
you know, they told me that at some point in the past I had a heart attack. It's like, it's kind of weird because, you know, on one hand, you, you know, I know in my head, it's like, well, I did. And it's like, it doesn't change anything. I am who I am today. And just because I found out that happened, well, it already happened. I just know about it now. Yeah. But, 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 you know, but it does kind of mess but. with you. So, yeah. I mean, with you know, both of us. Yeah. It's messing with us. So there's a lot of anxiety us, so. and stuff. You know, a lot of it's probably unwarranted. But, and then we had to change our plans because, you know, we're going to go to, uh, um, well, we're going to go up to Truckee, which is about an hour from, from our doctor in, in Gardnerville. Mm hmm. And uh, camp there for a few nights so we can make that doctor appointment. Um, if she wants me to go to a cardiologist or something, I, I guess I'm just going to. We'll, we'll, we'll figure that out. Yeah. You know, uh, probably. Whether it's. You know, whether they're a specialist it's, I, and it's not an emergency, so I probably yeah. can't get in for several months anyway. I'll just make it for about the time we'll be like over in the Bay Area. Yeah. And. Or just maybe talk to trip. her about doing, you know, seeing somebody on the road or something um, that she can recommend. But. In any case, you know, we're going to move on. Yeah. We postponed our plans for a week, but yeah, it's, yeah, been, a, it's been a weird week. We're not going to be able to see my dear friend Mavis in Bandon, but we'll see her on the way back down or something. We'll, we'll figure out a way to see her, but, um, you know, life happens. This is just another example, and yeah, we can be flexible living the life we are living, so we're being Yeah, I mean, flexible. honestly, you know, the ability to do what, you know, we're doing is change up our plans, you know, it's not like we had to cancel, yeah. you know, our whole trip or anything. It's like, you know, we're just going to continue. We just had to adjust things. Yeah, know? I mean, we had to cancel the reservation in Bandon, uh, but theoretically, we're going to get our money back. Um, but yeah. other than that, we didn't really have to cancel anything else. Yeah, we should so. still be able to, you know, uh, get up to Bend by the 4th of July. Mm -hmm. um, and stay there with Dave and Karen, and then and then our planned trip down the coast. Like I said, we might make a slight detour this direction to see a cardiologist in Reno or something. If if that's what I need to do, I don't know, but yeah, you know. But we'll make it work. Yeah. It's part of the lifestyle. It's flexible. So yeah. anyway, that's that's it. We just wanted to check in, say that. I know not everyone watches all three of our videos, you know. So I thought it was worth mentioning what had happened, you know. Just just for the record, I did not have a heart attack recently I on our anniversary years ago probably probably when i was working and stressed out so yeah so if you didn't see the other video explaining that you want to know more we talk all about it but i did not i'm fine um you know we're just doing our due diligence as far as checking that out but but uh yeah so, and we're and we're trying to get healthier and, and you know eat better and exercise more and so. yeah we've been good we have walked every single day we appreciate all of your uh, patience and understanding during all of this you know yeah. it is a trying time you know just because of the anxiety that that the the revelation that at some point in the past could have been 15 20 years ago that I had a heart attack and that you know I've got some scarring in my heart and stuff you know that you know it's just it's it's hard to deal with and you know it's it's kind of you know, it's it acts as a wet us. blanket yeah. on us, yeah. you know, and we're starting to emerge from it, and we will over the next few weeks. But we will, you know, it's just, we'll move on. But yeah. you know, it's just th thank you for your patience, and we really do appreciate it. And, and thank you so much for all your kind words too. I mean, it really does mean a lot that that you guys care. <laughs> yeah, we're probably so, walking all over the Friday video right now, but probably. But, but anyway, okay. So as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much for all your positivity and your amazing comments. And we'll see you all down the road. Bye-bye. Everyone. Oh, that's cute though. No, it's not. That's cute. No, it's not. It is. No, it's not.